So today we're going to be talking about if Stu is alive. Now if you guys know my channel, I talk about mostly everything. Talk about Scream, talk about all that stuff. And sorry that you guys can't see me right now. Um, kind of laying down. This didn't really, I don't really have like a software, uh, nothing like that, so like a laptop for the to make it a little better but anyways guys I, I just want to talk about Stu uh, Mocker for a little bit um okay so people's got this theory that that he is still alive um that he didn't actually die from the TV now, I could kind of believe it, I guess, in some ways, just because if he, I mean, it's just a TV. I mean, anybody can survive a TV, I mean, not, a, not anybody, but like, I mean, but there's certain, I don't know how to explain it, y'all, but there's theories that says that he's still alive, and I truly believe it, too. Like, I believe he's still alive. He was supposed to be in Scream 3. We all know that. Um, like, how that went. He was supposed to be in Scream 3. And he never showed up. Or he never got to uh, do it because of the combine uh, shooting stuff. Or the, the shooting stuff that was going on. Um, so, they ended up scrapping it they didn't like it so they got rid of the uh idea but he was originally supposed to be in the movie so that being said i think that's all the proof that you really need uh, you know to know that he's still alive um now do i believe he would come back in any capacity um like i said i i, I kind of like i'm kind of up in the air about that just because if it doesn't work right, I guess, I mean, you have to do it, you have to do it in the right way, you know? If you don't do it, you, you know, it's not going to work, it's not going to, but it'd kind of be pointless, honestly, at this point. And let me tell you why, okay? Not only are you bringing him back, but if you look at sydney or whatever because they're trying to move off move off of sydney that they're, they're, they're trying to move on to the next generation they're trying to move off of sydney as much as possible and that's what they're clearly doing we all know that um so if they're gonna do that why why would they want to bring Stu back if sydney's not going to be in the movie if sydney's not going to be in the movie what like, what's, at that point, what's the point, you know? It's like, you, you know, you're just going to bring her back and, what, kill Gail? I mean, what what does he have against Gail? He wants Sydney, you know what I mean? He would want revenge on Sydney, but, now, I don't want anybody to say that I don't want him to come back, because I do. I do, I really do want him to come back, but, but there's a certain way that you have to do it. I don't think he's going to be back in this movie, definitely not, but if he could, if there's a story and you could do it the right way and screen like seven or something or in the future, I mean, I guess it, you know, I'd be all for it, but I'm just saying like logically though, like how would you do it in such a way like because like if you're if you're moving off sydney like i said there's just no way that you could just bring him back because he would want revenge on her so at that point it's like well i don't think i think it's kind of pointless at this point in some ways uh but i would actually love to see Stu back um a lot of people would actually love to see him back. Um, but obviously, if you do bring him back, he's got to be a different character. He can't be the same, you know, person as he was. Um, so, 
that being said, I think it's very, it's, it, you know, a good writing, yeah, could work. Um, but at this time, like Scream 6 or something like that, I don't think it will happen. I just don't see it happening in this uh, next installment. I just don't. I mean, if I'm wrong, I guess I'm wrong. But I think it, if it does happen, it's going to happen in Scream 7. Or uh, in the future, like when they if they do like another like trilogy or something. But as of now, they ain't going to... I don't see it. I don't see them bringing them like back right now. Especially, um, I don't think they're going to bring it back. Especially if Sydney's not, not going to be in the movie now. That's another question. Is Sydney going to be in the movie? Well, we don't know. We don't even know if uh, Melissa Burr or, or uh, Jenna Ortega is going to be in the movie. I mean, we have no idea. The only person that we know so far that signed on was Gail Courtney Cox. And she's like the only one that signed on, so... I think that if, um, if Sydney's not going to be in the movie, well, there's no point in bringing, you know, Stu back, you know, he's not going to, you know, he's going to want revenge on her more than anything, you know, so, uh, so will Stu come back? I don't know. Maybe Scream 7, I think when the time is right, like Scream 7 would be bashed. Honestly, if he asked me, I think it would be best if he came back and Scream 7. Just because Scream 6, if Sydney's not going to be in it, what's the point? You know, he's just going to want to, you know, get revenge on her and all that. And she's not going to be in the movie. She's not going to be, you know, he's he would want to go after her specifically. Just because you know about their past, you know, like. So, it's like, man. Scream 7 would be, I think you would come back and Scream 7, but not, not this installment, personally. Um, but as I said, if they do bring them back, they have to make advancements, like, scars, you know, stuff like that on his face. You know, they would have to make them darker. They, they, you know, they wouldn't, like, not dark, but I mean, like, scary, like, evil, like, evil, you know? Kind of like a Billy Loomis kind of character, like, where he's just evil. He's not silly like he used to be. He's just evil, you know? So, anyways, guys, I think I'm going to end the video here. I just wanted to uh, make a video about that. If you guys think that he's alive or not, just comment down below. Um... Tell me if it's possible for him to come back in any way. Um, and yeah, guys, uh, have a great day. Peace.